Hey guys, this is your girl Lashes Tony XO. What's up? Um, we did a shopping, well I did, a shopping haul like I usually do on Sundays. Um, so we are going to get into that. We have MAC and Sephora. And yeah, so I'm going to show you my MAC and Sephora goodies. And I guess we'll start with Sephora since I've already got those out. Um, don't think I'm crazy or anything, but um, this is what I bought at Sephora. Went a little cray cray. Um, and then I bought a um, Bite Beauty lipstick for the fall, which I've never tried Bite Beauty, but this color, I've seen it on Instagram. And. Hold on one second, guys. Okay, guys. I'm back. Sorry, I forgot to shut the door. And there's music and TVs on in there. But I'm trying to get this video filmed before my husband gets back with my son. We have a meeting with the tutor. Um, so, anyway. So, so we're going to do the Sephora makeup haul. And then I have a MAC haul. But look at all my la my new lashes from the lore that I've got. Um, the one I'm wearing now is on my eyes. If you can see them. Now I have bought the Carly lashes online. I'm gonna be honest with you. Um, these are called Charlotte. And they look exactly like the Carly lashes, but they're cheaper. So, if you want to go to Sephora of Sephora.com and get the Velour lashes in Charlotte, they're going to be identical to the Velour lashes made by Carly, um, Carly Bible, and they're like. 30 something dollars so these are like 21 dollars so i'm trying to save you if you really really like her really like her style um I'm, like i said i'm wearing them now they just what they do is they basically just kind of flutter out at the ends basically is what they do if you can tell i don't know if you can tell or not but they basically just flutter like they're longer out like Bambi. They're longer out this way. And then they're medium. And then they go into short. So these are called the Charlotte Lasset. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> let me, let me, let me, let me get myself together. These are called the Charlotte Lashes. And I also have the Carly Lashes that I ordered online from the lore um and i put them side by side and they looked identical so if, i'm just trying to save you maybe 10 bucks if you want to go to sephora.com or sephora i picked these up in the store at sephora um and that's the ones i'm wearing today they do come with glue all these um plastic ones come with glue um the next ones i ordered how many did i get one two three four i got four velours one sephora and one mac so how many is that one two three four five i got six new pair of lashes so yeah i went kind of lash crazy okay the next lashes um i actually worn these um and the short long short long short long it just gives it a unique look so like i said these are very let me see. I might have my, my ticket in here and I can give you the exact price of the lashes. Um, okay. Um, the lashes are $23 a piece. $23 a piece. So, you're still going to save money because if you order them online, you're going to pay for shipping. And I, I believe they're in a $30 range. And like I said, this the um Scarlet not Scarlet. The Charlotte lashes are just 
identical to the Carly lashes. So if you want to save a little bit of money and you really want, you really like her style, I would suggest getting those at Sephora or Sephora.com. They do have Sephora.com too. Okay, I'm going to show you the other two velour lashes I picked up and then I'll show you the Sephora and MAC. Okay. Um, I also picked up, these are called Selfie. The reason why I picked these up is my one of my YouTubers, um, she's fairly new, but she has racked up some viewers, baby. I don't know what she's doing, but she needs to tell homegirl her secret. Um, she has racked up some viewers. I'm not going to mention her name, but she is one of my favorites. Um, and she picked up the selfies, and, you know, if she tells me to jump off a bridge, I'm going to jump. No, I'm just kidding. But... She said she liked the selfies. Um, she was talking about how great Valor were. She wore them in her wedding, blah, blah, blah. So, I was like, you know what? I'm just going to get all the ones I want. There was, some I li there was some I did not like. I put back. They were too Halloween looking, too long, too just not natural looking so I didn't get those but all the ones that I really really liked I picked up so these are selfie selfie lashes and these were kind of fun looking to me like I said these had the long short look that I like and they're spread out like I like they're called um they didn't like no they didn't because they're spelt they did and then in so it's like no they did and so yeah i just thought that was a cute name and they just really look like something i would love so yeah the ones i'm wearing today like i said are charlotte and they look like the carly lashes um that she has her name on they're just very like butterfly like where they're short here and they go all the way out and fan out longer at the end okay the one then i found these from sephora i usually don't get sephora lashes because i don't like i just they just don't like jump out at me or anything but these did they're called the hipster hipster lashes um and they're just very like i'll show you a close-up they're very wispy and dramatic looking and kind of they kind of look like they're curled or something i don't know they just looked like natural but a little touch of glam and they look wispy to me and they're called hipster and they're cheaper they're like 10 bucks so four lashes are super cheap um so yeah i got those i'm gonna talk about my my last um Sephora purchase and then we'll talk about MAC. Okay, I got Bike Beauty because I wanted a fall lip color and like I said, I was on um, Instagram and I had Bike Beauty on my Instagram and I saw this color and dyed. Um, I've never tried Bike Beauty but it just, I don't know, it just really looks beautiful. Um, can you see, it says bite right there. That is the color. I thought it would be gorgeous for fall. It is a crown. I'm really into crowns. I think I showed you, I don't have it up here. It must be my purse. But I have a crown that I'm wearing now from Lorac. Um, in Pink Rose, I believe it's called. I think that's what it's called. But look at that color. Very like a deep mauve or just a mauve color in general almost looks like whirl and i do have whirl lip liner um and i won't i was like this would be the perfect color for fall so i'm gonna swatch this somewhere i don't want to swatch it on the bronzer but i'll swatch it on my arm this is very creamy almost like a gloss and I'm going to swatch Whirl right beside it and see if I could wear these together because I think I could. I think they're pretty close in, um, I have my lip liners right here, so I'm not going to leave you. Um, 
You know what? Holy crap. I forgot. I gave away my favorite lip liner. Because I'm sweet like that. Um, if I would have known that, I would have bought a new one. Dang. Um, let's see. What color is this? I'll try this one. This is Laura Mercier. Um, let's see if this matches. No. The world would have been perfect, um, but I, get, I forgot I gave it away to a friend, and I know Spice is too neutral. Um, what other color do I have? I have Sora, but it's in my purse. Yeah. A little bit of a bummer there. Oh, let me see what this color is. I'm just trying out lip liners over here. Um, Okay. That broke, so that was an epic fail. Damn. Okay. I'm gonna work. Um, this one right here is Le Mercier lip liner in Plumberry. It's my newest lip liner. But I think Whirl would match better. Or maybe Sore. I'm wearing Sore today, actually. So, I don't know. But, this right here is a very... It's not matte. I thought it was going to be matte. But, it's very, very shiny. Can you see the shimmer? It's very, very... If I touch it. It's very, very creamy. Very, very creamy lipstick. So, I'm looking forward to wearing that with a good lip liner. I think I'm going to have to go back and get a whirl lip liner or just to bring that in and find one to match um because you know i love mac and any reason to go in mac to get something new i'm all about that life um so anyway i really really like this color i i didn't tell you the color did i brain fart okay the color is called rhubarb and yeah bite beauty rhubarb and it is a crayon, and I'm excited to try this color. It looks very fall-like. Because I don't like deep, deep colors, but I will go into mauves. So, I will probably wear this as soon as fall comes. You buying this, get, get me a new um, Whirl lip liner. Or I might try to find just another lip liner that goes with it because I know World's very popular. They might not have it. Sore might match. I will have to play with it and see. Um, I don't like it when it's too different, but I mean, if it's just a light, light difference about it, that's fine. But anyway, that is my lipstick or lip crayon from Bite Beauty called Rhubarb. So that's everything I got at Sephora. Sephora, my little Sephora package. I was gonna, they told me I was up for a perk or points. I could use my points. Had nothing, nothing good. The only thing good they had was something I really wanted, which was the um, Make It Forever, uh, like a little kit. But it was 500 points, and I had just bought that perfume, so all my points were like, so yeah. So let's talk about Mac. Mac, Mac, Mac. I should have got some lip liners. I'm a little bummed about that now that I'm thinking about it. Because I love Mac lip liners. Okay, so what did I get at Mac? I got another pair of lashes um, in the number 48. I've never, ever, 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 ever used um, this number. I always use Mac. No, Harley. I always use Mac eyeliner, blah, blah, not eyeliner, um, lashes, because look at the band on that, you cannot even see a band, that's how natural they look on your eyes, and they are gorge, and I saw these, and it reminded me of the 35s, if you know anything about me, you know 35s are my jam, 35s and the Urban Decay Trap are my two favorite lashes in the world, and I'm hoping I found a new favorite. Um, never tried these. They're again, they're 48, number 48, and they're $15. Um, they don't come with glue, but I like to use my own glue anyway. And I really like the um, 
spaces between them. I don't know. I it just give gives it more of a flirty natural look to me. So I'm excited to try these. I also bought a bronzer like like your girl needs another bronzer. I need another bronzer like I need another pack of lashes. I don't know. I love the color. If you can see, it's a bronzer, but it's got like a gold bronzy um, packaging. And it says bronzing MAC powder. Carly, go away. Mommy's busy. Okay, and this is the color. And it is called Refine, Re, what is it? Refine Golden. Yeah. And I'll swatch it for you. It swatches lighter than you think. There it is right here. So, I have bronzer on today. You know, the other day I didn't have bronzer on and I look, when I put bronzer on, I look like, woo! It was like, like a ghost. So, I better blend all this because I got like a meeting in like 10 minutes. I don't know what time it is, but look at my fingers. A mess. But yeah, I want a new bronzer. I always have to have new bronzers. If you could see my bronzer collection. Oh, if you want to see, um, I'm thinking about doing a series. And if you want to see a series, not this week. This week is all about beauty. Next week is all about unboxings. Um, so, the week after that, if you want to see a series of my makeup collection, trust me, it's huge. And I'm only going to do, instead of like 10 or 20, I'll show you everything. I'm going to do five of my favorite um, bronzers or five of my fa favorite lipsticks or five of my favorite lip products or whatever. If you want to see a particular thing, comment, leave a comment below and let me know so I can read it and I can respond to you guys and I will plan but I have a planner and I will put that in my planner for um not next week but the week after so be looking for that I, will, I think I'm gonna do a series each um each day do a new like nail polishes whatever I'm feeling if I don't get any feedback from you guys I will just do what I want to do you know what I'm saying the last thing I got from MAC is a nail polish in the new collection called Halt Dog. Everything is named after something that has to do with dog. So, the only thing I wanted in the collection was this gorgeous nail polish. Okay, it looks black on the camera, but it's not black. And it's called Snazzy Hound. Cute name. And I'm going to show you the polish. I'm fixing to go get a manicure and a pedicure in a few minutes. And I'm going to take this with me. And this is the color I'm going to use. Because I'm so pumped for fall, guys. Um, it's gorgeous. I put a little swatchy swatch on my finger earlier. And it is just like a really, really dark gray. It's not black. It's not black. Um, it's just a really dark gray. If you can see that. Not, It's not really gunmetal gray. Because gunmetal gray, I feel like it has has more of a sheen in it it's just more of a matte or muted dark gray so i'm very i've never tried the mac nail polishes but um i heard good things about them and i really really want to try the what do i call it the snazzy i was gonna say hog the snazzy hound i'm really excited about trying this bad boy so yeah, I'm supposed to go get a manicure pedicure while my son is at tutoring. And then I'm going to have a meeting with, with her and talk to her about what's going on with Harrison or whatever. But I plan on getting this color on my nails and my toes. Yeah, so I just wanted to show you what I got over the weekend as far as makeup wise. I went to MAC, went to Sephora. Yeah, I did a little damage. So, I just want to say I love you guys so much. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Like I said, if you have any comments or anything, leave them down below. And, um, yeah, I just want to say please subscribe. Uh, we are getting up there, guys. So, there's going to be a winner. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. October 7th, there's going to be a winner. I've decided to do a winner. I decided to do a runner-up. Now, if these two people are not... Um, do not contact me back. I will pick 
two more. Um, and I've already got the prizes picked out, and they are awesome. You're going to love them, and I hope you win. I really do. They're awesome products. Um, so, yeah. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button right there, 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 somewhere around there. And the Twitter button. And if you want to follow me on Google, too, you can, because I post pictures on Google. Um, but if you follow me on Twitter and uh, subscribe to my channel, you will automatic, automatically be entered in the drawing for my huge Lush giveaway. And if you get second prize, you're going to get some Lush stuff and also some makeup things. So, I wish you all well. Love you to pieces and I hope you enjoyed this makeup haul. Love you guys. Bye.